What's up, Wanderers? Today is an exciting day. Haley and I drove down to Ventura, which is right outside of LA for any of you guys that don't know that. And uh, we're picking up a new topper for the Tacoma. So let's head on over and uh, show you guys what we've got. Now, Katie and Thomas over at Top of Toppers are a great duo that run their camper company outside of Ventura, California. So if you guys are looking for an awesome shop, go get a camper, get it installed, and have a great quality service, professional install, this is the shop for you. It was surreal to see the Top of Toppers on the truck. We fully built this out on Top of Topper's website and the build quality is absolutely incredible. It is everything that we could have imagined and more. Now in order to complete our Ventura experience, we went straight from their shop straight to the beach where we had our first night in the camper alongside Highway 1 on the beach. First night in the new camper was a success. Now let's head home and give you guys a full walk around of this epic camper by Topo Toppers. Welcome back. We finally made it home and just wanted to do a quick walk around of the new camper for you guys. As you can see, we've got some things added to it. So we're gonna give you guys a quick rundown of our sweet new setup so far. All right, so we opted for the L-Track on the side of our camper because I knew that I wanted to add some Prinzu crossbars so we could mount our max tracks on the side. Eventually we'll get two more, but just wanted some quick, easy uh, disconnects so we can just get those guys out if we're in a hurry. They're not on top of the roof rack, so one person can do this compared to two people on top of the roof rack there. Uh, and yeah, it's been a great setup. Looks super tactical and really stoked with the uh, gray accents we're adding to the Tacoma. On the other side here, we opted for this little opening door here with the molly panel so we could mount some things to it. We've got our paper towel holder there. We've got our uh, first aid kit here and uh, leaves endless options for you guys to add whatever molly panel accessories that you want. You can also get your uh, camper without the molly panel. I just really like the whole tactical look and the uh, easiness of taking things off or putting things on and changing your setup up whenever you want there. We did opt for a driver's side 270 awning mount. We did have this on our last setup here, but this guy wraps around the whole side of the truck and that's why I opted for this opening window on this side because if weather is bad and we need to get into the truck real quick, we can have the awning out, open this guy up and everything's easy to get to, super nice uh, and lockable, which is a huge plus. Now 
now as you can see the living space is pretty cozy up there we are testing out the uh, lost horizon self-inflating pad I'm gonna test it out tomorrow camping with some dudes it should be really great but it was awesome to be able to deflate that pad throw all of our other uh, sleeping bags and everything up there be able to close the topper topper easily so we're gonna work our way in to the inside of the cab as you can see this has got a window on the door here and then when we move our way in a little bit closer uh, we opted for the lighting package on ours so basically you just hook up a jackery a power bank of some sort and then they made this awesome switch right here that you just switch on and all your lights are on there's two lights here and there's one up top uh, that is super nice and cozy once you guys get into camp and just quick and easy to shut off when you're ready for bed just just right there another really cool option that top toppers had was their canvas now this canvas is UV protected so the sun's gonna beat on it it's not gonna do anything even the mesh is UV protected so that thing is as dark as can be once it's all closed up or you can have it all open uh, in the summer looking at the stars but if you like it to be completely dark close that sucker up and nothing's gonna happen no sun's gonna damage it and yeah really stoked on uh, trying some winter camping obviously we're coming into summer months but really stoked to try it all season and see what it can take we really liked how spacious the inside of the camper felt we have a deck system here obviously but what's really nice is if Haley and I are working we're editing a video or photos or whatever these two panels can actually come out and it opens straight up so if you want to change with no one seeing if you guys want one panel in one panel out so you can set your computer up here to work it is super adjustable super user friendly and it stores away super simple we are pretty stoked to start editing on the road we need, to, need to plan a good road trip so we can do that we've got molly panels on the back that we've added some things to sliding window here for the dog sliding window at the front so we get some cross ventilation but overall we've been super stoked with the camper we only slept in it one night at the beach as you guys saw but stoked to get some more nights in this thing and give you guys another updated review of the camper so let us know what you think uh if you like the video if you like the camper give us a thumbs up maybe leave us a comment and yeah until next time we'll be wandering